Are your sales consistent day after day, hour after hour, or do your business demands fluctuate? Does your supply of goods and materials in and out of your business work like clockwork, or are there ebbs and flows? If you have either of these problems, you are likely experiencing one of the 10 enemies of profitability that we refer to as asymmetry. For many businesses, asymmetry is a real problem that is not well understood and rarely confronted. Asymmetry and the lack of strategy and tactics to combat it is an enemy that must be addressed to reduce waste. That's the way we do things around here. It only takes a few extra minutes. Now, where did I leave that at? If you have ever uttered or heard these phrases at work, then you are experiencing one of the 10 enemies of profitability that we refer to as deviation. Deviation is the inconsistency or lack of defined, standardized, or dynamic processes that result in fluctuations in quality and customer experience. Deviation is generally a cause or effect of poorly defined or non-standardized processes. Its presence is a sure sign that you are losing profits. The most common attribute of deviation is workers who cut corners, find shortcuts, or add unnecessary steps that impact the flow of operations and generate inefficiency. The founder of one of the world's largest beverage companies said that all waste is lost profit. Every motion, movement, process, action, or line of code that is not adding value to your product or service is waste. Waste left unaddressed deteriorates profitability. Let me ask you a question. Who on your team is responsible for identifying and combating waste? Who is developing strategies and tactics to motivate your team to destroy these enemies? If you believe that everyone is responsible to combat waste in your business, you are very likely losing profit. Every unnecessary action, excess material, or item reworked is a leak coming straight from your bottom line. If not attended to, these leaks will drain you dry and destroy your business. Everyone looks busy, right? Looking at the hustle and bustle of your business, you might think the faster people move about, the more profitable you are. In reality, the opposite is most generally the case. The transportation of materials and movement of people inside your organization is without exception waste. Ever heard of the work waste paradox? Only a fraction of the work done at work is work. It's true. Most employees spend less than 50% of their day adding value to the customer and performing tasks the customer is willing to pay for. The rest of their time is busy work, checking the status of something, retrieving materials or information, going to dreaded meetings, or the worst, looking busy but catching up on social media. Performing extra steps in a process are costly. Even though the argument might be those extra steps only take a few minutes, add those minutes up over a lifetime and you just lost your retirement. The enemy of overprocessing occurs when we do not have clearly defined or standardized processes. The lack of visibility to processes creates excessive labor costs and missed opportunities to innovate. Overprocessing can also occur when we start adding features to retain customers without any data to know if the customer actually values the additional features. Overprocessing creeps into most businesses under the radar. Left unattended, these costs can cut deeply into your profitability. Let's make extra in case the customer wants more. I know the order is for 100, but let's run 120 just in case. We're not completely sure what demand will be, but we have enough cash to produce 10,000, so let's do it. Overproduction is a beast that destroys profitability. It is an enemy of every business, but particularly caustic to companies that manufacture product. Assuming you will need more, or this or that, is almost always wasteful. Even with good projections, if sales come in at or under your projection, you're left holding the bag. A big old bag of lost profits. Rework, defects, returns, warranty repairs. These are all enemies that destroy profitability. These enemies not only cost you money, but they cost you customer loyalty and frustration. Many times, 
Defects cause you to drop everything and react urgently into a situation. Defects are waste, and all waste is lost profit. Reducing defects is always a good idea. Yet many people believe they need to eliminate defects to make an impact. Nonsense! Reducing defects by even a few percentage points can have a significant impact on your team, your customers, and your profits. To get started, you have to have a plan. What's your plan to combat this enemy? If you lack one, AMP can help. AMP experts are highly trained in the 10 most common areas of waste that plague every business. Our experts will create a customized plan to attack waste and make your business more profitable. What if the answers to all of your business challenges were locked up in your employees' heads? How would you access their thoughts and ideas? If you aren't thinking about this already, you're not leveraging the skills of your people. If they are laborers, the last thing they're thinking about is profitability. You've likely made it clear that they're just hired hands. Even your knowledge workers aren't thinking about being profitable throughout the day. If you're not leveraging their thinking, they're likely going through the motions or simply appearing busy, leaving a lot of room for improvement. A lack of utilizing the skills of your people is a highly common enemy of waste that deteriorates your profits. Are you fully engaging the thinking and skills of your team?